Hello everybody, first of all, just go to documents and you want to create a folder, a file like this, sorry, I've created my file and I've called it Z and I've saved it as uh, a docx file. Okay, so we're going to go back here and we're going to open this file. Yeah, we're going to open this file and uh, we're going to read it in the terminal. So first of all, we're going to import doc x to txt. This is the module we need to import. If you haven't got this module on your system, you need to download it using your uh, pip installer at the command line. So just Google that, Google pip and then install this module at the command line okay another thing we're going to import is os which we should have on the computer now i'm going to create a little function called open doc okay and we're going to create the path name there so you need to get the path name the path name for me is c users this might be slightly different for your computer so you need to get the path name for your computer and this c is going to be mark and we're going to say documents Okay, so that's the path to that file. I'm going to create list dear is equal to os dot chdir, which is change directory. So we're going to change directory to that path that we've put here. So basically, we're telling the computer to change directory to this is the change directory here to this path here okay and then we're going to print out the path uh, I'm going to create something called my text which is going to be equal to the doc x to t x t dot process and then we're going to type in our document which is z dot dark x and then all we're going to do is print out that document which will be printed out in a terminal my text and all that's left to do is to open the document right so there we go we're just going to uh, save it here and we're going to run the program and there you go Bob's your uncle and Fanny is your auntie so first off what we've done we've changed directory and we've printed out the path here and then we've printed out the text which is in the document so I hope you've enjoyed that remember to give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button below it take you one second and I'll catch you in another video bye bye